Right lads and lasses, Jacobs here and welcome back to another gameplay video. So today we're going to be playing once again COD World War 2 campaign and this time we're going to be playing the second mission, Operation Cobra. So let's press start mission, we'll write missions progress, regular, there we go. And there we go, I'll show up during the cutscene, or I might say occasional things. Like to comment, commentate on anyhow, or something that's worth it. Anyway, I'll show up for the time being. Maybe I'll get home by Christmas with a couple medals on my chest. But first, we gotta take Marinier. Schmeling, where's Lamada? Schmeling would have KO'd Lamada. No way. And Schmeling's a Nazi. I'd shoot him in a heartbeat. Now, they made him their poster boy. I didn't have a choice. We all got a choice. Mm, you know, Nietzsche said there was only oh, a strong... That's enough mouth. All right. Uh, what about Lewis versus Sugar Ray Robinson? If we're talking 1938, Lewis Robinson wins hands down. Hey. Nice to see that Zussman's re recovered. Not after I heard a bunch of tough SOBs were about to take Marinier. Hey, well, playbook's working. At this rate, we'll be home by Christmas. Don't just stand there. Let's see. All right. Not bad, eh? Oh. Yeah, I've seen worse. Glad to have you back, Private. Good to be back, sir. All right, fellas. We got a unique opportunity here. This is our chance to break out of Normandy. It won't be easy. The hedgerows are heavily defended. We got reports of crowd armor in the area. But if we can hold and secure Marinier, we own the roadways. And if Zussman can take a knife in the gut and come out swinging, I like our odds just fine. I always bet on a winner, sir. Returner, shielding us is his noble calling. Let's move. The war just has a habit of getting in the way. Right, there we go. We're starting. I think we're going to be getting air cover. So, so what have we got here? M1 Garand and uh, 1911. Not really too keen on the first weapon, but I'll, I'll have to do. If anything, I'd prefer like the bar or the M1 carbine. Like this takes eight weeks to heal. I'm ready, Sergeant. You've got my word. Oh, your word. That don't mean shit to me. Uh, so far, what I've noticed, like, Pearson's well, kind of a dick. I'm just fine and dandy, sir. You got guts, Bradley. I just don't want to see you. Nobody does, Pearson. You're not the only one. Tanks rolling! Right, so when are we going to be seeing combat, then? Hang on tight, boys. It's going to get rough. What else is new? I think Pearson likes you. Huh. Like a lion likes a steak. Let's go, let's go! Alright, so now we're rolling out on what I'm going to guess is an M1 Sherman. M1, M4, not too sure. Yeah, how about yourself? I couldn't let you guys have all the fun. Don't know too much about World War II military history. You know why he's always writing you? Mind you, I mainly got my knowledge from games, so I'm uncomfortable. Probably completely inaccurate, but at least it's worth something. Well, it might be anyhow. A massacre. Nazis had no mercy. Hell, we only survived because they didn't have time to seal the western exit. Almost lost everything thanks to that son of a bitch. But Turner still ain't over it. Matter of fact, he was the one who wrote him up. Pearson figures if he makes you a model platoon, he'll get it scrubbed. Only we're doing the scrubbing. <laughs> yeah. The so Pearson's practically using us then. He'd kill to have it removed. Or to like scratch it, scratch away at his bad reputation with his last platoon. If you've watched the last episode, you'll probably that probably won't make sense to you if you haven't watched it. So I go recommend you should. They never stood a chance. I'm guessing no to the open casket. Yeah, that's somebody's son. Nah, it's a crowd. Uh, Daniels is right. They're not all bad. They did give us Kepler, Mozart. All right, college. Marlena Dietrich. See, that's more like. It. Don't forget about their inventions. You got the printing press, electron microscope. Frank so Teke is the nerd of the group. You guys hear that? What's his name? Aleli or something like that. Oh shit, stuck a dive bombers. Um, I never realized how bad the armor is on these tanks because he just got bombed to shit. Right, there we go. We're mobile now. Get off the road! We'll circle around! Move! Well, we have to protect right, rally on Turner. Amir. 
gonna capture one of their AA guns to bring down That's our objective Turner. We're going to reach the anti-aircraft gun. Oh. MG. Oh shit, that I mean, that was a bad idea. Right. Oh shit, someone else there. Keep moving! I'm guessing one of the thing I'm guessing one of the things that makes the M1 Garand iconic is the metal ping each time you reload. Right, reloading. Shit, take cover. Oh, you're right, pal. Alright, I, I can see somebody up here. I was right. Oh, there we go. It took a while to kill him. Grenade. What does this do? Is this a stun grenade or a smoke? Smoke. Right. Gonna use this car 98k. It's bolt action, so. In games, anyhow, it'll do. Should be one sh one shot, one kill, or at least two shots, depending on where about to hit them. All right, there we go. Jack hops the quick scoper. One switch to a uh, SMG. What's it? What's this one? He was carrying. Oh, well, there was what? I just walked over it. Where is it? Come on. Right. Uh. Oh god, the Waffer 28, which is still haven't really seen. I mean, not seen. The Waffer 28, the one which I'm still not too sure how to pronounce. Right, uh, reloading. Wait, oh, fuck. it looks like it had a green uniform in that light. Shouldn't be going around tricking us like that, despite it's a really good military tactic. Well, I think it is anyhow. Oh, oh shit, no. Zussman. Ta. Right, we need to push upwards. Move it to the second floor. <laughs> just went up there and just like weapon butted him. I noticed in like previous COD games though, you had like uh, a knife instead of weapon button. I maybe like we're only given uh, weapon button in this because it's more historically accurate. Not too sure. Oh, holy shit! There's a lot of them. I'm glad I got my car 98. Well, one of theirs, anyhow, it's a German ball action rifle. Two shot kill. Move. Push him back. From the right, moving forward. Shit. Uh, kinda need cover, covering fire, because I'm about to make a run for it. Oh, was that a double headshot there? Two krauts, one bullet. Is that what the Americans called, like, Germans, like, in World War Two? Krauts, I think, what was it, the British called them Jerry's. Not really too sure what's with all the... Oh, wait, we have a surrender here. Right then, I'll have mercy. Go on, down. Down! Go on! Down, man! Oh, look! Oh, shit! It was a trick! Could use some help! Oh, well, thankfully I survived. Right, that's gonna encourage me, I won't take any prisoners now. I'll be merciless. Either way, that was a pretty stupid decision if you're surrounded by a whole lot of American troops and there's only two of you. I mean, that was a pretty stupid idea to say the least. Right, here's the AA gun. Right, move in. Isn't as difficult as the D-Day mission. But still, it's testing us. Oh, Turner, you got ammunition. Ta. Grenade. Oh, I can see him on the AA gun. I'm trying to snipe him. Got him. No prisoners. Remember what the last two knobheads done to us? Well, try to do anyhow. First aid kit. 
Right, now we're going to be using your own flat guns against your stu Stucker dive bombers. Two o'clock! Right. Oh, there they are. Come on. Uh, right, is there anyone else? Right, one o'clock. So... Why, why isn't it telling... Not there. Taking a while to show me. You failed to protect your tanks, what's that shit all about? You only done one run... Oh, wait, no. I realised it only took one run to destroy the tank, so... I have to remember that. Good, keep firing! No thanks for the order, Pearson. There we go. It would help if there was like another anti-aircraft gun so somebody could help us. Because it's practically me that's carrying a team here. Oh shit. Caught us off guard. Oh shit. Aye, decent shot. Just caught off guard. Shouldn't, shouldn't let myself be too distracted. Those stupid dive bombers are very effective. There we go, that one just nearly beheaded me. Taking risks. Yet again, that's what the strategy of war is about. Taking risks to achieve strategic goals. Right, come on. It's taking a while. Ten o'clock, high. And why are those white arrows? Oh, right, there they are. I didn't even need the white arrows because they're right in front of us. Shit! They let one pass. There we go. How many of them have a shot down? Good job, Daniels. Aye. Decent job. Hey, it's Perez. Hey, Perez. And he's Perez's tank army. There's Perez and his boys. There's our army. We're heading right into hell. We gotta hit those packs. And the German trench. I thought this was World War Two, not World War One. I. I got eyes on two packs. There we go, spot them all. We need to take out the people that are at the uh, pack 38s. They've actually got a proper. S oh, yeah, dude. 1903 optic. Right, come on. Headshot. Wait, to see someone else there. Right, where's the other one? I can just about see him. There we go. Come on, you don't rush across no man's land. Oh shit, if I noticed I'm trying to snipe them. I can see you over there reloading. Mind you, what I noticed that's kind of biased about this game is like the M1903 is simply the best sniper. I'm guessing that's because it's like an American developer and this is an American bolt action rifle. I'm not too sure. Plus like other war games like Battlefield 1, it focus on like several armies, not just like one. I mean, what from what I know of in COD World War Two, you like you're predominantly play, you're predominantly playing as the American Army, and I think there's one mission where you play as the French Resistance, but that's about it. It's still a good game though. You shouldn't really make, shouldn't really use that as a point to down the game. There we go, and the rover. Now I'm going to use one of the tanks as cover. Uh, all right, then I'll just use this as cover. It can't still be bulletproof. Already planned and stand behind them. Oh shit! Here, there's a grenade back. Don't try lobbing that at me. It does not work. Got one of the MG42 gunmen. Right side. Fire! 
Oh shit, the tank's armor got in the way. Oh shit, maybe she should get in that trench. Because I was getting shot to shit there. Have we got past the MG42 nests? I think we have. Alright, let's move up. The Germans are retreating. Ha! That's a good thing, isn't it? That's right, Fritz. We're coming for you. Keep moving. Keep pushing forward. Right, reloading. Hey, where are you going? Right, uh, stick behind the tank as it's good cover. I'm well aware of that. Just need to get to the sniping position. I know it's not very convenient, but you're going to have to wait until I get there. Oh, shit. Alright, so it's definitely guarded, so it's not going to be so easy. MG15. Uh, now I'll just stick with this uh, Waffer 28. Alright, taking a medic kit. I like how, like, uh... I was like, COD's trying to make like this, this campaign like realistic by letting you have first aid kits instead of just like your health automatically regenerating. Oh, shit, sniper! Right up here. All right, now we're going to be destroying uh, artillery and we're going to aim for the fuel cans as it'll explode. There we go, and I'll. Pick you up and all while I'm here. There we go. Objective complete. Me bother Perez. Let's move forward to drama. Right, is there any more MG42 nests around here? Because I could still see gunfire. Oh, now. Oh, wait. Alright, it's coming from this trench. Here, have a grenade. Any more? Oh no, I thought he was alive there. I thought wrong. Right, moving up the trench. Where is anybody? Uh... Oh wait, no. I never have, don't have turn, I forgot. Moving up with Pearson to try and capture this trench. Point him out, Sergeant! Point him out? There's, there's no one over there. Useless shit. Well, except for these people that just got shot. Hey. Right, rally on Turner. Meeting, it up, meeting him up here. Oh no, this doesn't involve me driving a car, does it? And quite shite. Lieutenant. Not just COD, but practically any game. And decent on bikes with GTA, though. Alright, listen up. Charlie Company's under assault near the church. They need ammo and fire support. Send a squad immediately. Sir, we're already stretched pretty thin. Then stretch thinner. Yes, sir. He's willing to take sacrifices. So we're going to need armored support. Right, that's the plan. Perez! Pearson will follow you with the squad. Can't do it. Just got orders from Collins. We're heading west with the 11th. Well, we're in a bit of a situation here, aren't we? You're on your own. Take the jeeps and head out. Move. And we are taking the jeeps. Right. The, inevitable, the inevitable's happened. Shit Creek and we're the paddle. Let's go. Let's go. Right up here, then I presume. Hey, which way to Marigny? Follow this road to the next village over. You better say things fast. I'm just going to follow the jeep in front of us because I have no clue where I'm going. Right, are we nearly there? Look out. Oh shit. We've got this way. Keep going. Oh, no, 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 not into a fence. Right. Past the crowd, the fences. Oh! Rod kill. And there's a tank right there. Only narrowly avoided him. There we go. Three defences. We need it there. Eh? 
Go straight, come on. Not really giving me, like, uh, he helpful advice here. I don't even know where I'm going. I'm probably just going in circles. And up, up the ramp. Right, we're going into a, a kind of cutscene here, so I presume they've done the right thing. Enemy jeep. We'll go drive it down. Oh wait, no, I just realised it's the car in front of us that just crashed. Come on, the worst drivers than me. They must be shite. I thought like having a mounted machine gun and a jeep wouldn't be very, very convenient. But surprisingly accurate. But I guess I'm gonna ha but I'm guessing they're gonna have to make it that way. They're all over the house. To make it usable. Right, clear hostiles. Well just of uh, a Jeep mounted machine gun. Oh, wait, did I just say a Jeep mounted machine gun? It just sounds a little stupid. Uh, a, ma a machine gun mounted Jeep. Right, uh, right. Down this crowd. So is this Marinier? Is that how you pronounce it? Marinier, Morang. One sure. And just healed myself there. Don't you be going soft on me, Murphy? Well, thanks for showing up when you did. Me, Bobba Pal. Okay. It's too late to press on. It looks like you boys got a reprieve. Excuse me, Sergeant. Yeah. Isn't half the crowd army on the other side of those buildings? Shouldn't we find a better place to set up a perimeter? Sure, Private. Why don't you book us a room at the Ritz? Sir. It's only a suggestion. Why don't you worry about your own problems? Like how that side is gonna hold up tomorrow. I'm right as rain, Sergeant. Dan. Doesn't really make any sense, right as rain, but sure. The only thing more dangerous than the enemy is pride. Rest up, boys. We take Mary Even worse, friendly fire is even more dangerous. Did you think of that, Pearson? Can't believe I'm fighting alongside Zussman again. He's holding up all right. Considering we just blasted through miles of hedgerows, you'd think Pearson might go a little easier. Well, that's Operation Cobra over with, and that means that's all I have time for today, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please be sure to like and subscribe. This is Jack Ops, signing off.